Welcome to Cooking with the Davises. Today we're going to have a meal that's going to require, um, we're going to do a pork loin, we're going to have some asparagus, and we're going to make a potato salad. And we have a special reduction that I'm going to make for the pork loin that's going to incorporate some blackberries, strawberries, apple, pineapple, lemon, pears, and brown sugar. We're going to make a glaze for this pork loin, just like you make a glaze for a ham. But we're going to incorporate all those delicious fruits. So, we got some cut work to do, some cleaning work to do. So, what we're going to do, we're going to start doing that. And I'll be back to show you how this meal is going to come together and the twists and things that I'm going to do with the different foods. We'll be back in a few minutes. This is just me cutting up the prep work for the food because what I'm going to do, I want to take it to a pot and boil it down and make a glaze over. A little more prep work going into all these dishes. Look at my fruits and stuff. And start making this um glaze. Oh, lost some hair, but you better believe I'm gonna pick it up. Adding some brown sugar to it so I can get a little bit of sweetness going. So I'll be back to show you when I'm ready to put this on my tenderloin. But I do want to show you in a few minutes what I got to do this tenderloin to be able to accept this glaze. Okay, be back. Oh, wee. Y'all ought to smell this. Mm -mm -mm. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn this off now and I'm gonna prepare my um, pork tenderloin ready to receive this glaze of goodness. I like that glaze of goodness. That's exactly what it is. You know we're going to do what we do. You know. You know. Go. Now what I'm going to do, I'm ready to put these two together. I'm going to score this a little bit. Well, I was going to score it. I might not be strong enough. I'm not strong enough. But my son may have to do it. But, well, okay, we'll do this. There we go. I'm going to score it a little bit. Mm. I'm gonna go back with it this way. This what the meat can get, the juices can get all inside. And now I'm ready to incorporate some of my house seasoning for one. My season. Don't worry about it. <laughs> That's Ooh, that. Oh, it smells good, Mama. That's how we're going to do that there. Now we're going to take this goodness and drill it all across the sea. Glaze it all. Just like cooking a ham. Mm. Let me get a zoom in on that. Oh, And I'm gonna cover this up in aluminum foil, and I'm gonna put this in the oven. And we're going to watch this thing do what it do. Mm. So, now I'm going to cover it up. And we're going to put this in the oven. And mm. we're going to cook this. All right, you got a good look on it? Mm-hmm. 
All right, let's cover it up, put it up. Now I'm working on potatoes for the potato salad. And um, I'm just cutting them up, getting them washed off, and I'm um, getting them on. I want to show you how I want to cook them as soon as I get through cutting them. I'll be back. I'm cutting my peppers up for my potato salad and um getting these ready to go into the um food processor to process them down because I'm still learning how to eat peppers and onions. And sometimes I got to trick myself. Yeah, that's alright. So here we go with that. So that's my cup. Peppers and onion corn in. Do I got yellow, orange? Mm -hmm. Is that red in there too? Yes, ma'am. Alright, What I'm gonna do next, and I'll bring you back to show you how I'm gonna do these potatoes. Alright, I'm gonna put my potatoes on. Don't judge me. Just watch the process. Put my potato salad. Just for the potato salad, right? Yeah, just for the potato salad. And now you said, I'm going in. And you said don't judge me because of what? The way I'm going to make this potato salad is going to be what you call a, my version of this fried potato salad. Oh. That's my twist. So now I'm going to use some of my special house seasoning. It ain't what you think. It's no salt. I use as much as I like. Mm, that smells good. So I see the leaves with this. And like I did my potatoes before in one of my um, videos, I'm not going to stir it too much. I'm going to stir it a couple times. A couple times. Let everybody get to know each other. And I'm going to cover it up. And these will be done. And I'm going to put that potato salad together like so. So I'll be back when I'm ready to show you the potato salad. But before I go, I want to show you what I'm about to do to this tenderloin. No, I'm going to go ahead and go and I'm going to come back in a few minutes and show you this tenderloin. But this is what these potatoes are going to do. I'm going to cover them up. I think that needs a little more seasoning in it. And I might have to go back and season again. Once it become a potato salad with the other stuff, but we won't know that until a minute. So I'm gonna cover it up and let it do what it do. I'll be back in a few. I don't. Go. Now what I'm gonna do? I'm ready to put these two together. I'm gonna score this a little bit. Well, I was gonna score it. I might not be strong enough. I'm not strong enough. But my son may have to do it. But okay, we can do it. There we go. I want to score it a little bit. Mm. I'm going to go back with it this way. This what the meat can get. The juices can get all inside. And now I'm ready to incorporate some of my house seasoning for one. My seasoning. Don't worry about it. <laughs> That's Ooh, that. good, mama. That's how we're going to do that there. Now we're going to take this goodness 
and drove her all the way across the sea. Glazed them all. Just like look at the hand. Mm. Let me get a zoom in on that. Oh, mm. and I'm gonna cover this up in aluminum foil, and I'm gonna put this in the oven. We're going to watch this thing do what it do. Mm. So, now I'm going to cover it up. We're going to put this in the oven. And mm. we're going to cook this. All right, you got a good look on it? Mm-hmm. All right. Let's cover it up, put it up. All right, y'all, I'm checking on this tenderloin. Look at that. And Ooh. the flavor that this stuff is making. And when I get through, I'm going to thicken it up and serve. I'm going to slice it and serve that glaze on top of it. Good God Almighty, y'all. And so now I'm gonna put it back in the oven for a few more minutes. And when I come back, and oh yeah, asparagus cut. Excuse me, excuse me for a second. Asparagus cut, tips cut, washed, and everything. That's done by my daughter, Dora, who don't wanna be on camera today. But anyhow, we already cut it. And what I seasoned it with was some Pure olive oil and some of my house seasoning and a little bit of um just a little handful, palmful of chicken bouillon. It got a little salt. The chicken bouillon, if you know if you cook, you know about it. And I've dripped a little bit of that over it. And so now I'm gonna cover these asparagus up and I'm gonna put them in the oven until they're far tender, still have a bite, and I wanna bring it out. And so when I come back, we're gonna sit down. And we're gonna put this potato salad in the in put it together and I'm gonna put it in the refrigerator because I like my potato salad cold, not room temperature. So when I be back, I'm gonna be ready to put this potato salad together and then I'm gonna slice my meat and guess what? This meal is gonna come together. See you in a few. My bouillon is done. Hey boy, wake up and get on this channel with me. Here go my brother, over here visiting, waiting for this meal to come together. This is my older brother, Twan. He's waiting on this meal to come together to see what his sister putting down. What's up? And we got some more company in here waiting for us to put this meal down. Let's go see what we got. Welcome to our home. And this is our den. We got some more people in here waiting for this meal to come together. That's my little Williams family, my great nieces, nephews, my nieces, her fiance. They got my mama. That's Dora back there in her room doing what she doing, waiting for this meal to come together. We'll be back, you two. All righty, y'all. We're about to put this pen top together. This is how we did it. The potatoes that I cooked on the stove. There they go. Potatoes and onions and pepper. Now, this is how I do my potato salad now. You do yours the way you want to. I don't like a smushy potato salad. I don't like a mashed potato salad. I like my potatoes to be whole. So the way I'm doing this, them onions and peppers, that's what you see. It's in there. So now, we're going to make it do what it do. Onions, peppers, green, yellow. I forgot the green, but we're going to use pickles that I made myself. Eggs, I like my eggs to be kind of 
I like eggs. I like a lot of eggs. So that's four eggs chopped and ready. Boom. And what else I like is my potato salad. I go with my seasoning last. But here goes some more peppers, onions, and stuff if I need it. I need my mayonnaise to go in there. Use any kind of mayonnaise you want to use or dressing that you want to use to your liking. And if my son can go get me that little spreader, I'll get back with you and get this mayonnaise out. Mm. All right, mayonnaise going in. And I don't like a wet, wet potato salad, and I don't like a dry one. So I'm going to start out with that much, maybe that much. I've always just taught to put a little bit of ketchup in it, not a lot. Squirt, squirt. That's what my mama do it. That's the way I do it. Mm. A squirt, squirt, a mustard. Now, what we got in this cup is a cup of goodness. It's pickle relish, whatever. But, um, I'm going to use that. Uh-oh. Oh, my God. The smell on this is like being blessed. That's pickles. Oh. Use a little bit of that. Oh, we got a whole pickle still didn't get ground down. That lets you know I did eat pickles myself. <laughs> Some of them didn't get bust down. So I'm going to take them whole ones out. That don't mean they ain't going to get eaten. So now I'm going to fold this in. And my potato salad. That's what I'm going with. Now, look at that color. I barely need any paprika. Uh oh, y'all. Uh oh. Y'all know what I forgot to do? Add a little bit of seasoning. This is some basic chicken bouillon. And I don't need it's just for the salt because my seasoning don't have any salt. So I need a little salt to go in here. And that's all I think I'm gonna put it in. But I'm gonna taste it, and if I need some more, I need some more. And here goes my bust down. Bust down house season. It don't matter about that damn food. And we got some parsley going in. Now, fold all that in. That's my potato salad. And it is like ready for me to go ahead and get a little, my little side fork right here. I gotta taste it, y'all. And see, do it need anything else? But the peppers and onions, guess what? It's in there. Like swim more. So I'm gonna give a little bite of this and put my own fork. Matter of fact, I'm gonna put it over here to the side. I just want to taste it. And I'm going to try to see me taste it. Because it needs something else. I'm done. I'm going to go out here and trick my niece. She don't eat onions and all that stuff. I'm going to have her taste it. And I'm going to put her on camera taste it. Be right back in a minute. But it's good. Bye. My niece, Janaysha, take big in there. I want you to taste everything. Okay. Mmm. That tastes really good. <laughs> Jay, guess what? Not for real. Guess what's in there? What? I use. Oh! oh! Everything. Oh! Yep. <laughs> But it tastes so good. Yep. Talk to the camera. Y'all, this is so good. I don't even eat onions. But... At all. And I have to make her and me a separate potato salad years before. But now with the way I'm doing my peppers and onions, 
Mmm. That is so good. And here we go. Onion, peppers, red, yellow, orange, peppers. It's in there. Mmm. Got them, got them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's good. You gonna take that coat with you? <laughs> yeah, I play house. Yeah. yeah. It's in there, pumpkin. The God, the way I cooked it. That is wonderful. The way I told you how I cooked mm -hmm. it. Like the potatoes with onions on the stove. That's what I did. This is good, for real. I can't believe it. You can't even taste the onions. And that is a wrap. I'm jealous. That's good, though. <laughs> but you oh, yeah. eat onions and peppers and all that, oh, yeah. right? Guess what? Mm -hmm. You don't see them, though, do you? I don't trust them either, but they, they do. They in there all the way up and through there. Oh, yeah. mm. I made my own relish. Mm. Yo, well, you seen my make the pickle relish, right? Mm. I made my own relish and my little own secret little stuff that I put in my own relish. Made food. And you can tell I made it because they're on my pickles. That's how it go. Mm. While you're over here doing some stuff, boy. Yeah, you did that. Never. Back up, boy. Back, back, <laughs> up. back, back. Back. Uh oh. Sorry. <laughs> That's how they manipulate the door. Keep it like really. Take one taste. <laughs> Dory, do you want to taste while the camera runs? Yeah. You can wash it off. Get door. Come on, door. I can't believe you had called me in here first. Well, I know that I will get you at dinner. Let me see. Let me see. Camera. Camera. No, real. No, I need to look at you. Oh, that's what it, no. You made it. And I made my own pickle relish. Look, really? you can tell I made my own pickle relish because look, some of them pickles didn't get bucked out. But I made my own relish, y'all. Mm. This is so good. This is good. I'm your friend. Okay. I'm done. Mm. And that tender line is done. about that meat right there? It's pretty good. For real? Uh-huh. For real? Yeah. And he's a picky eater. <laughs> For real. He's yeah, a really he's picky, a picky eater. eater. And y'all see like that? Y'all see that? Gone. Dead mission. Oh, Not even a mission. <laughs> mission complete. Yeah, Red Jack, what you think? What you think about the food? It's good. It's good, Lyus. Taste the potato salad right there. Tell me what you think. Don't love me. That meat. Tell I do what you think. What's that? Not too much in your mouth. What you think? What you think, Jamie? It's really good. I didn't spare it. Mm-hmm.